This ape says no one can predict a catalyst that will cause a stock to rip unless they have something like insider information. And it happens when it does. Like back in February 2021, AMC randomly moved up and in May of 2021, no one Nostra stonked it until the move up decided if the stock is worth buying now. So this tape just reminds us all that we don't know when this thing is going to happen. We don't know if we're going to wake up some random morning in the next week, in the next month, and all of a sudden pre-market. AMC could be up 20%, 40%, 80%. We've seen this happen in the past. If you've been holding onto AMC for multiple years now like I have, you've witnessed it with your own eyes. I can promise you that. But regardless, it's just a good reminder that anything could happen at any time, but as long as you're holding, you can potentially be within the action. This ape says, I actually like how some fake apes have gotten impatient because eventually slowly, one by one, they've been disappearing on my feed. Or maybe I'm just blocking them, ignoring them, etc. Along with other apes. Either way, I see strong sentiment mostly now. And I will say for me personally, I definitely watch what's going on very, very closely, as I'm sure you guys know. And the sentiment is getting better. There was definitely a moment a few weeks back where the sentiment was very, very bearish, but things are turning for the better. AMC to the moon. We have a new post from Unusual Whales, and guys, hold on tight because this is a bad one. Unusual Whales says Jim Cramer has said the economy is headed for a soft landing. So during the whole situation where the Federal Reserve has been raising interest rates and the whole economy going into a time of contraction, there's been a saying that the economy is going to have a soft landing or a hard landing. And Jim Cramer apparently thinks it's going to be a soft landing. And whenever Jim Cramer knows something, we know what's actually going to happen. This is pretty crazy. It says Citadel Securities alum accused firm of harassment and intimidation. And then just a snippet from the article says a pair of former Citadel Security employees asked a federal judge to thro throw out a trade secrets lawsuit, arguing that their new firm operates in a market that their old one said it would never enter. Interesting. This post says AMC linked Highcroft Mining Faces, illicit short selling manipulation worries the CEO warns. And this is in regard to Highcroft Mining, the mining company that AMC purchased a large stake in a year or so back. Now, this was identified by trade imbalances concerning its shares. So even if nothing else comes about this, at least there's starting to finally be some more awareness around what's potentially going on here. Because Highcroft, for good reason, has reason to believe that we are witnessing short selling manipulation right in front of our eyes. And the CEO is definitely concerned about that. Comment down below just out of curiosity if you currently own any shares of Highcroft Mining. I consider buying a bunch of shares a little bit back, but haven't since. Comment down below if you have Highcroft in your portfolio as of right now. This ape says it's hard to watch, but this level of crime is unsustainable. The billions of AMC shares they have created in just the last few days is huge. This is going to blow up in their face. It feels like we are getting closer and closer to a pivotal point in this entire play, whether it's good or whether it's bad. It feels like things are starting to heat up.